Hello. Hola. I'm Brittany. And I'm Brad. And we are Audio Shell. Before we start, make sure to click that red button down below to subscribe to our channel mm-hmm. and get the latest videos. Mm-hmm. And also hit that little bell so you can stay up to date whenever we release a new episode. So today we're going to be doing our like 800th, not really, but book mail episode. Yay! Yay! We love book mail episodes. And we want to thank everyone who sends us books to review and also bookstores because we go buy the books. We want to thank them all. Yes, I'm about to explode because this is a huge book mail episode. This is a huge one. I I mean, I feel like it's not huge to like normal booktube Mm. standards, but Mm -mm. we're not normal booktube and... And it's huge to us. Exactly. And size doesn't matter. Yes, it is. Anyway, so let's start off with the one that we all know and love. Mm -hmm. We know we got this in the mail because we didn't get it really in the mail because we bought it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this didn't come in a package at all. We went to the bookstore after we talked to this author. Oh, we talked to her. We talked to her. We got drinks afterwards. Yes, we did. It feels like a fantasy. We were so awkward. We had no idea. So awkward. She was so pretty. Yep. Yep. Kimberly Bells! Kimberly Bell! The last breath. Uh, so this is her first book. So we had to buy it. It was there. We said, let's support her. Let's bu- let's support our local indie bookstore. And we bought this book. And it was the best decision we've ever made. Best decision. It's one of the ones that we don't have. Yes. So it made perfect sense for us to grab it. She even signed it for us. She did. Mm-hmm. I already showed the people at home. Ooh. You can see it again. Red ink. Red ink. Uh, oh. So we can't wait, wait to dive into that one. Yes, we're really excited for this one. So this avalanche of books. Ooh. Oh, girl. Ooh. All right, so this next one is... Ooh. This is by C.T. Santa Maria. Oh, dang. I know, that's a fancy-ass name. That is a name. Mm. And this book is called Mitchell Beckett and the Search for Velmira Delphique. Dang. That's a French ass title. That is. That is like so fancy. This wording, I mean, like, there's some like big spaces. I can't wait yes. to dive into this. And mm. thank you so much, CT, for sending this. She actually sent this like through her Amazon account, which is amazing. And the gift receipts just flopping out out of it. So thank you so much, CT. And we cannot wait to dive in. Yes. This looks like a short, you know, story about 295 pages. Yep. And I'm obsessed. And it has that soft cover that we know and love. Mm-hmm. We rub our face against it all the time. Yummy. It's great. So the next book that we have is... Ah! (laughs) Sorry, we've been waiting for years. Oh my God. Well, I felt like it's been years. Uh, So Grave Maidens. Brad is the exaggerator extraordinaire. I am, I am. Uh, So Grave Maidens, written by Kelly Kuhn. She's amazing. Such a sweetheart. Can't wait. Yeah, we cannot wait. Like, look at this cover. It's so... So pretty. Like this jar with these moths and this blue stuff. I don't even know. Oof. But it just looks so cool. And the title is neat. Like everything just feels right up our alley. Mm-hmm. When the postman delivered this, I almost knocked him out. I said, give me my book. And he like was like, here you go. And threw it. And I said, thank you. Did you catch it? Yes. Okay, that's good. This book comes out October 29th, 2019, but we will be reviewing it before then. 100. So you can put it on your pre-order list, on Halloween wish list, if yeah. you get gifts for Halloween. I don't know. I want to start giving, getting gifts for Halloween. Books are the perfect gift to give yeah. for Halloween because you can get some spooky books. Some spooky books. Yes. That's a good idea. Right? Mm-hmm. You should start a new tradition. Mm-hmm. Please add this on your Goodreads. Do it. It's going to be worth it. I know it's going to be amazing. Mm -hmm. So our next book, we're very excited because this is one of our favorite authors. She has always supported us Mm -hmm. and we just love her so much. And for the audiobooks of her books, that doesn't make sense, but whatever. She always teams up with our favorite narrator, Lauren Ezzo. Hello, Lauren. (laughs) So we cannot wait for this book to be turned into an audiobook. Yes. And what's interesting is that this is the second in the in a trilogy that is all coming out in 2019. It's crazy. 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 Three books, one year. Yeah. It is Into the Hourglass by Emily R. King. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Look at this mermaid tail in the back. I love mermaid. mermaid tail. I love mermaid. It's so cool. I love this mermaids. is such a cool cover. Like, what the hell? This is amazing. Oh I can't wait. I can't wait. Oh, I love a good book cover. Oh my, oh my god. Wait, what is the hard oh wait. Oh my god. Alright. Oh All my right, god. Girlfriend. My heart hurt. My heart hurt. Look at the 
hard cover. Can you even believe Brad is like dead right now? What did you do to us, Emily R. King? We got more book mail. <laughs> We got more book mail. We do have more book mail. Oh. I'm going to put this back, but we're so excited for this. Thank you so much, Emily R. King, and everyone at Amazon Publishing for yes. sending us this book. Oh. Mm. Brittany Russell, you, you are homegirl, girl. Girl, girl, girl. Girl, girl, girl. All right, so are we ready for this? <laughs> we have zero idea what this is. So we can either be, we have like, we haven't opened it yet. We haven't opened it. So we just got it today. And so this could either be a really like hyped up surprise or it could be a really big <laughs> letdown. I can't wait to see our faces to watch this back. I can't wait. So the only clue that we have is that it is sent to us from Bloomsbury. Yeah. And so that's all we got. Yeah. Here we go. Are you ready? <laughs> yeah. ah. Shut the front. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I feel like I just barfed. Oh my god, my heart. And it was a good barf, even though barfs aren't good. Oh my god. <sighs> Tell them what the book is. Tell them what the book is. It's a heart so fierce and broken. <laughs> My birthday camera. Oh my god, I'm gonna get this tattooed on my face. Please don't. Yeah, sorry. Oh my god, it's the sequel to A Curse So Dark and Lonely. I'm waving it in front of my face. You probably couldn't even hear what I'm saying, but I don't care. I'm so excited. So excited. Oh my god. Yeah, this is what we were hoping it was, but we weren't getting our hopes. I mean, we got our hopes up. We got our hopes up, but we've been waiting for this book ever since the first one came out. Oh my god. We, we ran through that first one, like our eyes were like going so fast. Oh my God, so many words. And we soaked it all in and we loved it. This is from Bridget Kemmerer, who is a dear friend of ours. And yeah, there's a new character. There's a new character. There's a new character. Oh, we've been waiting for this. I can stop bugging Bridget about it. Yeah, <laughs> you can get off Bridget's jock. I can get off her jock. That's it. This book Ugh. comes out January 7th, 2020. Yes. I could have said 2020, but I I'm just too... I can't. I'm too emotional right now. Uh, you wonder I have tears in my eyes. I think you're wondering why I'm holding this. So this beautiful art print, you can pre-order. Once you pre-order the book, save your receipt, go to this website. It is bit.ly we'll put, we'll put it in the thing. Just say we'll put it in the thing. We'll put it in the thing. And if you pre-order, show them your receipt for the pre-order, they will send you a beautiful art print of this picture. So do it. Oh, can I see? Yes. <gasps> it's my favorite quote from the from the original, see, the initial book. What am I saying? I don't know. It's my favorite quote from Curse. I just love it. Can you read it out loud? Can you read it out loud? I am always surprised to discover that when the world seems darkest, there exists the greatest opportunity for light. <sighs> how does, how do these come from brains? How does this come from brains? I don't know. Oh, I'm so excited. I could, I could cry. I'm so excited. I'm crying more than I did over you asking me to be your major of honor. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah. Oh, it's beautiful. my goodness. It's a beautiful book. It's beautiful. Thank you so much for Thank Bloomsbury you so much. and Bridget for sending us a copy of this book. Obviously, we're hyped. Yes. <laughs> I mean, obviously, a little obviously. bit. A little bit. <laughs> we, uh, uh, yeah, we got it. Mm. So thank you again to Emily R. King and Amazon. Mm -hmm. There is um, Kelly Kuhn and Delacour. Mm -hmm. We just, uh, we love them all. Thank you yeah. guys so much for sending us books. CT, Santa Maria. I'm going to like be obsessed with that name forever. It's a name. I love it. I love it. It's such a good name. Mm. Yes, thank you so much again. And please, if you want to stay up to date with all that we are releasing, please subscribe to all of our social medias. We are on Twitter at Audio Shelf Me, Instagram at Audio Shelf underscore podcast, and Facebook at Audio Shelf. And we also have a Patreon if you want to sign up for exclusive content that can only be gotten by our patrons. You can sign up over there. There's information down below. Where? Where? Just down below. So until next time, bye. bye. Oh my God. <laughs>